This demo will show how to use optimized rasters to convert and optimize imagery from one format to another. Here I'm in ArcGIS Pro and have a directory that includes two subdirectories, each of which contains some images as well as some metadata. What I want to do is go to the optimized rasters site on GitHub, go to Setup, click on the EXE, download it. This will download pretty quickly. Once downloaded, I can run it, do the install. It stalls into a directory. If I then go back into um, ArcGIS Pro, go to Catalog, click on the toolbox and say add a new, um, sorry, um, add toolbox. And you will see in image management workflows, optimized rasters, there's optimized rasters, add it. Now the toolbox is there. We can then double click to run optimized rasters. It prompts first for um, a configuration file. This gives a number of different options. I'm going to pick the simple convert imagery to TIFF with JPEG compression. And it's going to ask for um, a type of a source. This is in this case a local local file. And I'm going to actually point select the images. So if we go, it was in source V, it was the Dale JPEG images. Um, and I'm going to ignore these for the time being and select the output folder. Um, we're going to put that into um, the optimized V Dale J directory. And the other parameters are primarily for use um, if you want to use optimized rasters to load imagery into cloud storage such as Amazon or Azure. There's also advanced option here where you can actually see a number of the different parameters. In most cases you can leave those as they are. I'm actually going to change the quality of the compression, um, the JPEG compression within the TIFF files to 85% uh, or rather quality 85. So what I'm doing is converting the images from JPEG files to TIFF with JPEG compression and defining a quality of 85. I can run that and this is going to start optimized rasters. This runs relatively quickly. So now optimized rasters has finished. We can see that it took um, about just over a minute to do that conversion. And if I go into um, catalog, uh, go back to my optimized the directory, do a refresh, and now we see that those files have now been dropped in there, and we can quickly, easily get access to those images very fast. If we go back to the, to the, to the resulting directory, uh, let's go there, you'll see that this directory now contains those files, whilst the source directory um, contained um, 375 megabytes of images. Um, this new directory, if we look at the properties, um, contains about 400 um, megabytes of data. Remember that these new optimized images now actually have overviews on them and that make, ensures that they have very fast access. Okay, that was it for that demo. Thanks. Mm -hmm.